Katya, Assemblywoman, Assemblyman, always a pleasure. We're taking precautionary measures. The city of Newark, uh, in testing their orthophosphate, uh, trying to make sure that it was actually getting into the system, making sure that it was actually wor working, began also looking at some of these filters. We went to three homes uh, with the help of the EPA. Uh, we tested four water filters in three homes. Uh, two of those water filters came back uh, where the lead was not reduced to a level that we uh, uh, were comfortable with. Uh, since we discovered that there would be the, our, excuse me, our corrosion control uh, might have been losing its effectiveness, uh, we began to introduce a new uh, chemical, which is an orthophosphate, into the water, into the Pequonic system. Newark has a little over 18,000 lead service lines uh, in the city. We, at this date, have maybe given out about 38, 39,000 pure water filters, uh, you know, to mitigate uh, those households that have lead service lines. As a precautionary measure, we all got together with the EPA. The EPA made its suggestions. We talked through that. We wanted to be able to put a system together. We were able to do it on Monday to distribute water until we figure out what's happening. We absolutely do not have enough information one way or another to determine whether the filters are working or not. The, the the word expiration is is not an accurate assessment. It's best used by, uh, and and we've got a whole new generation of bottles uh, that are in there. I'm not sure what date they have on them. I'm not sure if Dan Kelly knows, uh, but th those the, the first batch of bottles, the current batch and the future batch batches are all completely safe, and the the state has I believe about if to, to anticipate this about seventy thousand cases in our emergency operations. Uh, we need the federal government also to to be the main actor in the long-term fix in America, not just in Newark or New Jersey, uh, in terms of replacing and having a water infrastructure uh, renaissance. Um, and that is an, a, a step in the long term we need the federal government uh, to take.